Welcome, young mathematicians. Today, we embark on a magical journey to discover the different ways to express numbers. We'll learn about numerals, fractions, and decimals. Get ready to be amazed by the wonders of math. First, let's talk about numerals. Numerals are the symbols we use to write numbers. They're everywhere around us, like on clocks, phones, and price tags. Here are some examples. 1, 2, 3, 10, 100. Next, let's explore fractions. Fractions show parts of a whole. A fraction has two numbers, a numerator, the top number, and a denominator, the bottom number. For example, 1 of 8 means 1 8. 1 half means 1 half. Imagine you have a pizza. If you cut it into 8 pieces and eat 1 piece, you've eaten 1 eighth of the pizza. Now, let's discover decimals. Decimals are another way to show parts of a whole. They are written with a decimal point. 0.01 .01 is the same as 1 out of 100. 0.75 is the same as 3 quarters. 0.25 is the same as 1 quarter. Decimals are handy when dealing with money and measurements. Do you know understanding numerals, fractions, and decimals helps us in many ways? To share and divide, for example, share food, toys, or chores. To measure accurately, for instance, follow recipes and measure for projects. To handle money, say, count and save money, make purchases, and understand prices. Here are some fun activities to practice these magical concepts. 1. Cooking together, use recipes to practice fractions. 2. Shopping trip, help count money and check prices in decimals. 3. Craft time, measure and cut materials, using fractions and decimals. Math is magical. Keep practicing, and you'll become a math wizard in no time. Thank you for joining me on this enchanting journey through the world of numbers. Until next time, may your days be filled with wonder and numbers.